Hi guys, it is an absolutely spectacularly gorgeous, over the top beautiful day here in the end times in paradise at Bugs in a Jar Farm on this unbelievably gorgeous Sunday afternoon, August 6, 2023. So, uh, before I head up into the deep woods to continue my trail building out here, checking out these uh, jopai weeds, which are at their pretty much their height today. And uh, the tiger swallowtails love these things. So we have tiger swallowtails, we have the bumblebees. And we have a bunch of these little tiny bees. Uh, I can barely see them. I think these are called mason bees. They're a native species of pollinators. So we have three native pollinators here enjoying this bountiful universe. Uh, this bountiful universe on this gorgeous day, not one sign of an invasive European honeybee. So I'm sure a book hermit would be happy to see there are exactly zero invasive European honeybees working bugs in a jar farm. But there is no shortage of the... Uh, of the native pollinators. So I have gone a little bit crazy on uh, <laughs> on Joe Pie weed. You know, you just find something that works for you. If you if you find a plant, uh, I'm I'm really hoping Joe Pie weed is a native of upstate New York. I'm pretty sure it is. I mean, if you find th this beautiful plant that is absolutely free that uh it looks beautiful it's very easy to grow at least uh where i am it uh attracts pollinators i mean it is joe pie weed has everything to recommend it i'm gonna make a uh I'm going to plant this all along the street in October. Hope it survives the uh, snow plow and whatever crap it is they put down on the uh, roads. So I am moving ahead with the Joe Pie weed and I'm thinking I'm finally going to get a blackberry harvest this year. I can sense blackberry cobblers in my future. Man, it is. I mean, look at look at the bounty. Mmm, all right. I have been ranting about the collapse of a planet all morning, and now it's time to get out there and enjoy my little piece of the planet while I still can. This thing, I guess it's called a sedum. Looks like a giant broccoli. I'm a... <laughs> Wait to see what it looks like. Here is the Joe Pie weed out by the tiny house. Thing is close to eight feet tall. I planted this Joe Pie weed. I think Alistair and I planted this two years ago. But I'd better put some water on my uh, better put some water on the planter box. These little impatience. Like they need some water, we might actually hit 
80 degrees today. So the gladiolas are finally coming in to bloom. Look at the color on that beauty there. All right. I am off to exercise my... I already forgot what it's called. Up into the woods to trailblaze. Bye, guys.